Hey, it's Aidan here, AidanCoin.com, where I teach you how to play in Dadgad guitar. This lesson, we're going to learn a song called Welcome Poor Patty Home. If you haven't heard it yet, I'll leave it in the description below or up here in the corner. You can check that out. In that video, I recorded about four years ago. I play it in the key of A, I believe. So that's capo on the seventh fret. I'm going to teach it in the key of D for you. Depending on your voice, then you can change it around. So I'm going to go through the melody at the start with the eight of tabs, and then we'll go through the chords with the chord diagrams for the verses and the choruses. So I'll play it in the key of D for the moment. It's a little high for me, but I'll give it a go. I am a true-born Irishman. I'll never deny what I am. I was born in a sweet Tipperary town, 10,000 miles away. So array me, boy, array. For no more do I wish far to roam And the sun it will shine in the harvest time To welcome poor Paddy home Into that melody again Cool, so let's get learning this melody at the start anyway So I'll bring up the tabs for that So we have the first note is up on this 7th fret of that G string so it goes seven, six, four, six, seven, two. So that's the first little section there. Seven, six, four, six, seven, two. And you might notice that you can play this with open notes. But the reason I don't is because I want these high A and D strings to be ringing out while I'm strumming the whole melody. And kind of keep things, keep a nice flow going. If I was to play it with the open strings, things get a bit more constricted and things don't ring out as nice for me anyway, so I like to play it up here. So depending on your, your own playing, it's, it's much easier to play it in this position instead of jumping from the 7th fret back up and down. But I do play it in the key of A, so it actually is a little easier to play that melody. So depending on your voice as well, it might be handy. So let's get back to it again. So 7, 6, 4, 6, 7, 2. And then we have this hammer on and pull off. So that's open, hammering on with the first finger on that second fret of that G string so and then pulling off with that first finger four hammer or pull off on that two zero four five from the top again so that hammer on pull off again then pull off four five So just kind of get used to that melody first and then what you want to do is start adding in the rhythm as well so it's in six eight this song so one two three four five six one two three four five six we want to add that into the melody so one two three four five six one two three four five six So I'll try and count it out. We'll see if I can do this. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. It's tricky. One, two, three, four, five, six. 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 It's like rubbing your head and your belly at the same time trying to count this. Let's see. One more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Close enough. So it's basically how you how we count it out, and it's take your time with us trying to get the metronome out and just get that strum going and then adding in the melody. It's a lot easier when you don't have to count it out. So let's get on to the, the chords now. So we'll start with the verse chords. So I'll clean things up there. We have 
The first card is going to be this D shape. So we go through each shape first. So if you haven't uh, got a lot of Dadgad cards yet, there's plenty of videos on this channel for that going through Dadgad cards. But this is a, a D modal card to start off with. First finger on the second fret, fourth finger on the fifth fret. And we're doing a walking kind of bass line down. We're going, going from this D to C sharp to B. So first card, little finger up on the fifth fret, then we're walking down. Third finger is now on the fourth fret. Then we have this one finger, first finger on the second fret, playing that B. And then we have this third finger is going to be on the fourth fret of that low D string. First finger on the second fret, that G. And then back down to this D modal one finger chord. So that first line. So you can see that some bars have two chords in it. The very first bar has two chords, so that's counting it is one, two, three, four, five, six. 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 And then on the second line, one, two, three, four, five, six. 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 So that second line, there's just one difference, which has this E minor chord in there. After that, F sharp shape. We're going down second finger on the second fret of that low D, third finger on the second fret of that low A. So from the top, going through that verse, Three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Drop down. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. Now with some lyrics, so it goes, I am the true born Irishman. I'll never deny what I am. And walk down again. Town, ten thousand miles away. And then we're into the chorus. So just practice that part, those chord, those verse chords, uh, nice and slow with that rhythm, six eight rhythm. So then we're going into the into the chorus. So it's a little easier with the chorus because the first two chords are just going to be holding this D. So bring me boys, one two three four. Then we have to walk down. So let's go through these one at a time. We have the first card is going to be that D, second card is going to be the D, third card is going to be D, and then we have that walk down, which is going to be our C sharp, B. We're doing the same walk down again, D, C sharp, B, and we have the F, E minor, D, just like the verse end of the verse so the only difference are really those first few chords the first line so array me boys array for no more do i wish for to roam the sun it will shine in the harvest time to welcome poor paddy home one more time say array me boys array for no more do i wish for to roam Sun, it will shine harvest time to welcome poor Paddy home. And I counted out so one, two, three, four, five, six, two, two, three, four, five, six, one, 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 two. I messed up there one more time. Two, three, four, five, six, one, 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 two, three, four, five, six, eight. Array me boys, array. Walk down, down, wish to do wrong. The sun will shine, how's time to welcome to and then we're into the melody part again. So I'll bring that one more time. We'll try and stitch everything together. And we'll bring up the verse as well. So from the top, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. I am a true born Irishman. I 
never deny what I am. I was born in the sweets of a rare town, 10,000 miles away. Into the chorus, say, array me, boys, array. For no more do I wish far to roam. In the sun it will shine in the harvest time to welcome poor Paddy home. Nice one. So I hope you got something from that. Um, the, the only other thing I can add in really is the for the chorus, I tend to do a lot of muting. And if you haven't seen my muting video, I'll leave that below as well. You can check that out. So it's just just getting this nice, powerful drive behind it. The boys array. And then you can open things up for maybe the last chorus. The boys array. So it's nice having those dynamics in and muting really does help with that. So do check that out. Um, if you did like that, give it a thumbs up. Uh, there's plenty more songs and tunes and dadgad lessons on this channel. So do subscribe and I will see you on the next one. All the best.